Hello, hello YouTube. It is your friendly neighborhood content creator, Ender Steve, and I'm finally back bringing you some more big brain content. So first off, I just want to say a quick apology to anyone waiting for this video. It's definitely been a very, very long time coming. I've been working on this video probably for five days or so, six days, almost a week, and I've just gone through so many, so many, so many issues. Uh, the world was corrupted at one point. I had to read to a few days worth of work um, and then after I got through that then just I had so many issues recording so we're probably on take about a million right now so if you want to go ahead and like this video that would mean the world to me because I am probably on hour 72 trying to make this <laughs> trying to record this video and it would just uh, mean the world to me but uh, yeah before we start this video I just want to say a quick welcome to anyone new this video will be up on my channel on the front page for a little bit. So hello, my name is Ender Steve, and for the time being, I make Minecraft content for the PS4 edition. So if that's something that you're into, then definitely consider dropping me that subscription. And yeah, uh, one thing I don't want to forget to do is just thank all the people who have been there for me um, from the time that I started YouTube. <laughs> That probably was that was a weird way to say that, but I just want to say thank you to all the people who have continued to support my channel since I started. It really means a lot to me. Um, like I said a few times, I really was not expecting this whatsoever. Um, even though I, you know, I haven't been growing super quick, it's it's definitely quicker than I was expecting. Uh, so thank you, thank you, thank you. And yeah, let's get into the actual meat and potatoes. Once again, hopefully I don't mess up. If I do mess up actually during this video, I'm probably just going to keep it in there. So uh, do bear with me. I've been I've been at this for for days and days, literal days. I've been I've been working on this world and trying to record. Uh, but yeah, you know, there's some there's some new stuff. Not too much new stuff on the spawn or in the spawn. You know, we added some wreaths. We we gave it an overall Christmassy vibe, but not even that much. Just just a few, just in a few ways. Uh, added some orange trees even though it is Christmas time and I imagine oranges are probably not growing at the moment but uh you know Minecraft is Minecraft it can be whatever you want it can be Christmas and not be snowing uh but yeah you know we got some bamboo pretty much everything is the same as it was uh we're actually going to jump over that tripwire for the time being and just show you a few things in here we got some Christmas ornaments once again Christmas theme it's almost Christmas it's the holiday times Christmas creepers. <laughs> I do just want to say that I, I was raised Christian, so I, I do celebrate um, Christmas, so that's why everything is kind of Christmas themed. Hopefully once uh, I get some more people on this world, it'll turn into, you know, having more themes instead of just Christmas, because obviously there there's a lot more holidays going on around the Christmas time, so I don't want to, I don't want to ignore those. I just, I really know nothing about them, so I, I don't want to act like I do you know <laughs> uh but yeah this is uh we're now coming up on the council of big brain you can see there's a lot of stuff change over here we got some presents once again christmas theme we added some greeneries over here we got some hanging plants which i thought were really really nice the vines definitely do it uh the only thing is i had to put a bunch of string around it which i don't think you can see right now but yeah you can you can see it right there there's a piece of string piece of string <laughs> But yeah, I'm getting a little bit distracted as usual. Uh, this this you might have seen on Reddit. This actually completely popped off on Reddit, which I was I was really glad about. Uh, I think I got almost 2,500 likes, which is pretty cool. I made this one night when I was really really I don't know. I was out of it. I was up way too late, and I was just building on Minecraft. And I made this uh, this really derpy Santa Claus and reindeer <laughs> scuff Santa is what I called it. Uh, but yeah, yeah, we're getting distracted once again. Um, I actually have an announcement for the Council of Big Brain, so so get excited real quick. Uh, we still have two more, count them, two more spots left on the council. So if anyone wants to uh, go ahead and drop a CBB down in the comments, you can go ahead and join the council real easy. We don't really have uh, any type of check or anything like that, which uh, you know probably isn't the greatest idea. But <laughs> you know we just. We let anyone in, it doesn't matter. Just just drop a CBB down in the comments and uh, there you go. One thing I do want to say about that is uh, we don't have any females. 
uh, now I can't obviously I'm not going to tell you guys like oh, you know you have to be female but uh, it would be nice if we had some female uh, interaction going on on the council because at some point the council will end up making some uh, some decisions for my channel and I don't want it to only go in one direction I want it to you know I want I want some uh, I want some uh, some uh, variety so to speak uh, but yeah drop a CBB down in the comments if you think that that would be something you want to join and thank you thank you thank you here we are we're at kind of the town square uh, we're at the billboards where I like to commemorate my different milestones and once again we finally hit a hundred so thank you guys I couldn't have done it without any of you honestly I literally couldn't have <laughs> if none of you press subscribe I, I literally would not be here so uh, I just want to say a quick shout out to you obviously if I wasn't making these videos I wouldn't have any subscribers either but you know I don't really want to act like it's all me because it really isn't it's uh you guys obviously have to like my content and yeah uh, thank you thank you once again yeah let's get into this a little bit more we have a whole bunch more stuff to do uh, usually I, usually the past few videos we would end it off here but as you can see we actually finished this whole entire plot these one two three four five six these six different plots we finished every single one of them and yeah they're looking really nice there's a lot of detail kind of jam-packed into these little tiny spaces so we got a nice little farm uh, one thing I added was tough guy Phil right here he's kind of like a cowboy scarecrow or at least when I look at him, I can, he kind of looks like a, like a cowboy. But uh, Tough Guy Phil was, was a, a hall monitor at my old high school who uh, unfortunately passed away recently. So I figured I'd throw him in my Minecraft world. He was, he was one of the people I actually liked who worked at my school. I was, you know, I was, a, you know, teachers thought I was a slacker. I'll just say that. So, uh, <laughs> so he, you know, he was kind of cool. He was just a hall monitor. I would always go out. And talk to him and stuff like that but yeah of course nobody really cares about that you guys care about this creative build and I'm glad you guys do because it took me a long time uh, over here we got a vineyard which I would definitely recommend adding to your world it adds a lot of uh, adds a lot of flavor <laughs> it adds a lot of, of character I guess to 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 like a uh, to like a space definitely and then we of course have a melon and pumpkin patch and a well then over here we actually have these two different buildings that I set up. This one's not really a building actually, it's just a park. It's Yeeters Park, so if any one of you are coming from Reddit, you will instantly know exactly what this is. Uh, these were really popular on Reddit and I think they're probably one of the funniest things you can build on Minecraft, so I added just a whole bunch of them in. Um, I was kind of imagining if we ever needed to defend ourselves against anything, we could just you know, call upon the eaters and have them destroy our enemies <laughs> but yeah over here we have a simple you know little outhouse if you can see it there's actually oh I guess I didn't add it to this one but uh if we actually go over to this side I think I added like toilet paper or something like that I don't know I, I think uh the world corrupted actually actually uh deleted that and I never added it back in but anyway over on this other side we kind of have like the opposite kind of uh, idea like over there they kind of blow stuff up they destruct a little thing you know they destruct some things over here it's good golem fire outers so they actually do the opposite so they they stop things from getting destroyed uh, over here you can just we you can see we have stacks of wheelbarrows just filled with water and obviously you know these good guy golems or good golems would just yoink one of these and hut 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 and just go over <laughs> and put out the fire. And over here we just have kind of like a uh, a wheelbarrow filling station. And yeah, let's get into we're getting close to the end, so I do want to urge anyone who is still watching just to go ahead and like this video. I didn't say it at the beginning because I didn't want to annoy you guys. This video is about you guys, but I still do need to say it. Go ahead and like this video drop a comment if you're still here watching my content um share this video with your friends that'll help absolutely way more than any of anything else that i'm going to say so definitely consider sharing this with with uh with the homies with any minecraft ps4 veterans or even some minecraft ps4 noobs just share it with anyone really 
drop a comment again, and then, uh, you know, like the video, all that. I, I can't remember what exactly I said so far, but <laughs> you guys already know what I, what, I, what I want you guys to do. But yeah, here we have kind of like a smithy. Uh, these are one of my favorite things to do. This is actually where I got the wheelbarrow uh, idea from. But yeah, over here we have a small, uh, small little uh, workstation, I guess you could say. We have an anvil, a small thing of water, and a fire you could dip the, the kind of iron rods into or whatever, whatever you're making. Over here we have a like a larger size foundry, so we have a bucket of lava in there. A nice little cauldron to pick up some lava. And then we even have some molds right here, which I thought was a really great uh, detail I could add. One is a sword, obviously, and I'm guessing this might be like a small shield or something. Or it just, could just be like an ingot, like a, a round ingot. But yeah, this is the smithy's house. Up here we have his living quarters. Uh, nothing fancy, just some tools up there. Um, I guess those are his tools and not like the, the shared tools. We got some furnaces. We actually have a secret spot, which I'm not going to actually tell you how to how to get into. You guys are kind of going to have to figure that out once you get once you actually are able to get on this world. Once you guys kind of pester me enough, once I open this world to you guys, that's one thing I do want to say. I'm I'm really just waiting for you guys to 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 let me know that you want to come onto this world. Like if if you guys want to play on this world, that is why I'm making this world. So just just go ahead and drop a comment. You know. I can't wait to work on this world, stuff like that, you know. Uh, after a certain amount of those types of comments, that's when I'll open the world to everyone. So it's not, it's uh, it's not just going to be based off time or anything like that. At at one point, I was thinking that that's how I was going to do it, you know, just after a certain amount of subscribers. But really, I, I, I want you guys to let me know when you wanna when you wanna come on, because uh, obviously I haven't done too much. Like I've only finished the spawn basically, and. Uh, a little tiny like like I said before like six plots basically that I finished so uh obviously the content would dry out pretty quick so I'm definitely waiting you know as long as I can to to let people on but if you guys want to if you guys want to quicken that process just go ahead and spam me every single video just when are we going to get to go on the creative world when are we going to get to go on the creative world I want to go on the creative world uh but yeah once again I am rambling, as you guys already know. I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, here we are at like the last plot. This is going to be the last one we're going to go over. This is the last thing I pretty much built. You can see over here, everything is unchanged. But I'm very excited about uh, expanding into that area. It will be absolutely insane. A whole bunch of work for me to do, which I am <laughs> kind of excited about a little bit. A little bit nervous, but I'm very excited about it nonetheless. This area is kind of like the church area. We have uh, the Church of Ender over there, and then we have Pastor Rich's house right here. And then we have just a kind of little Easter egg. This is Charlie Brown's house, Charlie Brown right here. And then Snoopy up here on his uh, doghouse, even though this is not a doghouse, it's a tree. But <laughs> I, I didn't really have room for a doghouse, so I built a tree. Uh, but yeah, um, there's some kind of specific things about the church that I want to say like the church is very fancy we got some nice red carpet Pastor Rich really really uh, put a lot of money into this church which is kind of cool he's got the surround sound you know so the worship the worship team can be heard throughout this really really small building <laughs> but uh, yeah he's got the speakers there uh, I don't know I thought it was kind of a cool addition but uh, one thing that I, I made that I thought was kind of cool is a little parkour thing so these are all fence gates right here, so you can actually open them up and jump on top of the church. And then, if you didn't notice, Pastor Rich's house has an iron door, and you actually can't get in there. And there's kind of a little bit of an Easter egg down there um, once you actually get into his house. But but we're actually not even going to go in there. We're uh, I'm just going to let you know that that's there. It's going to hopefully get you guys a little bit excited to come onto this world and search for more secrets, because I will assure you there are many there's one over here you can see it kind of right over there I'm not going to tell you how exactly to get over there but uh, most of you probably should figure it out very easily um, obviously we got some some stuff up there inside of these presents there's going to be stuff um, there's already a bunch of secrets at spawn that I've never gone over um, but yeah hopefully hopefully this kind of stuff gets you excited to come onto this world and do some uh, and do some uh, um, 
and like kind of like join a community almost like I really can't wait I uh, I don't really play with too many people on Minecraft just yet because um, every time I join into a world everyone always has so much stuff and I don't want to just start with iron and, and stone tools when everyone else has full diamond and you know I'm just over there grinding while they're just kind of you know working on some massive farm or something like that so I I, I'm, I'm, I'm really excited to get this world done specifically so everyone who plays on it can just we can all start fresh we can we can start together specifically and then we can all just kind of advance at a similar pace uh, so to speak which I think will be really fun uh, it'll be really fun to watch really fun to, to join into as well and yeah it's, it's something I'm really excited about so definitely once again Consider dropping a like on this video because it'll help me so much. Drop a subscription if you feel the need to. If you like Minecraft PS4 content, if you play Minecraft PS4, definitely consider subscribing. That would help you out a ton. I'm always making new videos, new content, stuff like that. Uh, like the video. Share the video. That'll help way more than anything, like I always say. If there's going to be one thing that you're going to do, definitely share the video because that'll help the most by far. But yeah, this is uh, this has been Ender Steve. I kind of put down my controller to say that to you guys. I'm sorry. But uh, this has been Ender Steve. I hope you enjoyed this video. And yeah, I'm signing out for now. And I hope to see you very, very soon. Hopefully in the next few days. But yeah, hope you have a great rest of your day. This has been Ender Steve. And I'm signing out.